Honkai Samurai has dropped a new Marius Celeste trailer, which I kind of predicted that it will be released either around um, on a Thursday or Friday, which is today. So, without wasting any more time, I will be checking out this Marius Celeste trailer. Without further ado, let's check out Marius Celeste trailer, Kyoden, a cliff across the Tensian world. Do you okay. still remember why he's forged what is these this? blades? Oh. Because in times past, when the Yao Yorozu no Kami descended here, they wrought death and disaster on this world and its people. That's me! To save the world. That looks like me from Honka Invector. He's most splintered 70,033 blades and forged them into the 12 sentinels. Whoa. That looked like modern Japan. The first was A truth, modern futuristic Japan. Revelation. It could teach mortals the way of the law and create miracles from the deconstruction of all things. The second was sky forged by the eternal zenith. It could form a barrier from the firmament and prevent the innumerable gods of misery from passing Whoa, through. what am I looking at? The third was Howl, able to summon lightning to rend the heavens and meteors to rain down divine punishment. Okay. The fourth was Mist, able to break earth and tear cloud with biting wind and rain. Okay. The fifth was Frost, freezing the land in an instant. The sixth was fate, the restless cycle of life and death. Oh, the red flower. Then there was flare, thought, root, form, bind, maw. With those sentinels, we seized on tomorrow's expectation, winning victory after victory until all of them were broken. The price of every victory was a world in its entirety. And in the end, that entirety was lost. And so Izumo splintered twelve sentinels and forged them into two bearers. The first was Origin. Okay. The second was End. The world forged 70,047 blades, and only one could save Izumo. Wait. But I heard it's too The road to salvation does not exist. There is no trace. Is this a backstory to regarding to Izumo? Resisting the Kamigami, humanity will eventually become Oni. We pawned everything more for the destruction of two worlds. Whoa, what the hell? In times past. Takamagahara, upon which the Kami descended, was surely as beautiful oh, as Izumo. The blade's broken. So, do you still remember why Izumo forged these blades? Because of a lie. An end that never existed. We long since strode into their shadow. Each step forward, one that we can never follow. Until the last blade is forged into me. Not. Whoa. It's... This is practically Akron's back... backstory. I knew this... this world was fleeting. And yet, and yet. Okay, so that, okay. That is basically Akron's backstory. Because. Whoa, 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 whoa. If Akron's. You know what? Let's watch that trailer one more time, but in Japanese version and with the captions on. Because there are a few things that I need. There, there's. Uh, my head, there's a lot going on in my head right now. Because, but you know what? Let's just watch the Japanese version. Izumo ga katana wo tsukuru riyu wo 
覚えているか遠い昔八百万の神が降臨し<笑>人々を害したからだ世を救うため She definitely looks like me in the movie. She definitely looks like me in the movie. She definitely looks like me in the movie. Twelve sentinels, okay. So, no, it's my cotton. Truth. So, no, it's my cotton. 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 So, no, it's my c マガツの神々が通り抜けられない壁を築く、うん、そのさ、メイ稲光をよ空を咲き内帝で天罰を下すそのよう嵐ミスト風雨を荒れ狂わせ大地を砕くその後そうフロスすぐには消えない塔その6命ルテンする生と死そして列各石杖線即食十二フレの刀を使い私たちは明日への期待を胸に勝利を収めていったそれら全てが折れるまで勝利の代価はこの世の全てそして最後にはそのすべてもそこを尽きた。出雲は折れた十二振りの刀で、容易の刀二振りを作った。Two barrels. 始まりと。終わり。七万四十七振りの中で、出雲を救えるのは一振りだけ。はあ。だが。存在しないと人類は神々にあらない神々に自らをアッキーへと変えた全てをかけながら僕たちが手にしたのは二つの世界の破滅だあの神が落ちた高間ヶ原も昔は出雲のように美しい場所だったのだろうそれで出雲が刀を作る理由は覚えているか一つの嘘と存在しない終点のため私たちはとうにその影に足を踏み入れたもう後戻りができない最後の刀が作られるブラスマカマリ And this is how May becomes Akron. But then again, in the treasure program, Akron is a fake name. Kono yo ga tsuyu no yo ni hakanai to shite mo. Sore de mo. Whoa. I hope that once we meet Akron in the version 2.1 story quest, we will get to learn more about her backstory and about Izumo. Because I believe this is the very first time Izumo is being mentioned, officially mentioned to be precise, in a Honkai Star Rail trailer or video. So. I'm genuinely curious what in the blue hell happened at Izumo. And from the look of things, right, Akron is definitely from Izumo. She's definitely from Izumo. But judging from this Maria Celeste trailer, something definitely happened at Izumo. But we have no idea what in the world is going on. So the only way to find out is to. I hope I really really hope that we will get some answers in version 2.1 once um, the trailblazer meets up with Akron. 
So I, will, I really hope he gets some answers. So the, the other than that, there's nothing really much that I, I can talk about for for this Malay sensitive trailer. Other than than the fact that it really piques my interest on what in the world happened uh, at Izumo, and I want to learn more about Akron's backstory. Because from the look of things, like Akron is definitely is a very interesting as time goes by from the way I see. 